Okay, let's talk about how to make a photo slideshow in iMovie. So I'm going to open up my iMovie, and here are all the projects that I'm working on here. And if you're not here, just hit the back button or, or just keep going back till you get to the project. Sometimes it goes right to videos and it shows you the videos that you have stored on your iPad. I'm going to tap on projects here. And then, of course, I'm just going to tap the plus button to get a new one. Tell it I want a new movie. And then here are the different themes. I don't really use the themes, so the modern one is fine with me, so I just tap on create. And then I have the project right here in front of me. So I'm going to change over here on the right side. I'm going to change it from video to photos. And then I'm going to go, since I'm doing one on sea turtles and I just got the images from Google, I know they would be in recently added, but you might have to dig through and find your photos that you're looking for. I'm going to scroll down to the bottom of recently added because it works in opposite order. And here are my sea turtle photos that I'm going to use. So you can just tap them in the order that you want. I'm going to start off with that big blue one. Then I'm going to go to them as little hatchlings then swimming with the fish. And this one here is a beautiful one. So you see I'm just tapping them to load them in and it loads them in each for a few seconds and then you have a nice slideshow. So those are the ones that I want and if I just rewind it and I press play you can watch what it looks like here. See how it just kind of moves across the photo. That's called a Ken's burn effect when it kind of moves across the photo and it does a dissolve into the next one. Looks really nice. And the next one. So that looks really good. Now I need to put a title on this otherwise my teacher is going to go crazy and not know whose this is or what's it about even though it's pretty apparent. It's about sea turtles. But to put a title, I'm going to tap on that first clip. I'm going to tap on the T down here for titles. And I'm going to say, I'm going to go with a prism one here because it'll look nice underwater. I'm just going to double tap the text up there so I can edit it. Let me just backspace. I'm going to say C turtles. Close my uh, keyboard there. And let me just my clip again to close the menu down here and we tap outside of it. Now watch when I hit play. See it kind of comes in there just really nice. It blurs in. That looks good. So sea turtles. So now I've got a nice title and at the end I'm going to put who it's by so that no one else takes credit for my work. So I'm going to maybe just do this one in the bottom here, this lower third one. Tap on it so I can edit it and put you know, by Brad Wickinger. Done. Okay. So there is my sea turtle photo slideshow made in, in iPhoto, I mean in iMovie. So it's, it's great and it's ready to go. And then once you have it, you can export it to whatever you need to. So if I close this here, I mean, sorry, not close it, but I just hit the back button here. So I go back to where my movie is here. To change the title of the movie, you just tap on it up here and I could change it to whatever I want it to be. Okay, Here's your chances to play it full screen, export it, or delete it. I'm just going to hit the export button or the share button and then I could save the video to my camera roll by hitting this button here or I could, you know, I could email it to somebody using the mail button or different ways to do it. I'm just going to save my video. Um, I'm going to save it in medium, not very good quality. It makes it smaller, easier to email and now it's exporting it and it'll be under photos in my camera roll.